Hello everybody, welcome back to Writing with Miss Casto. We are working on opinion writing. It's what you think. That's right. So today we are on, we are still on page four. You should be on page four of your writing paper. If you don't have it, do what Miss Casto does. Draw your box and your lines and you're good to go. So Today's question, I think I typed it wrong on your piece of paper, so just listen to, to it from me. Um, the question today is, who is your favorite teacher and why? So that should be pretty easy. Hopefully you have a favorite teacher. So take two seconds, think about who your favorite teacher is. Good, all right, so hopefully you have it in your head. Now think of some reasons why they're your favorite teacher. It could be a he or a she, whoever you've got. So think about why you like your teacher. I know for my teacher, she is happy and she is funny. So I want you to think, why do you like your teacher? It could be something just like how they are or maybe something they do. So go ahead and take a minute to think. All right, good job. If you need some more time to think, pause the video and then come back later. So remember, when we are writing opinion, we have some special words that we use to help us write our sentences. So this is where our challenge is going to come in today. But let's start with what we know. So we've been working on using these words to write our sentences. So far we have, I like blank, because blank. So you're saying, I like Miss Casto, just as an example, I like Miss Casto because she teaches me writing. But here's our challenge today. I want you to think of more than one reason for why you like this teacher. So in order to write that in a sentence, if I like um, Miss Carlson, that'll be my example, I like Miss Carlson because she is happy and funny. I'm going to use the word and today to make my writing even better because we want lots of reasons for why we like something. Sometimes one just isn't good enough. So today we're going to write at least two. So let's get started. What are the first two words that we write? I like. Let's get started. Go ahead and write your I like, and I'll write it too. All right, so you should have I like. Now, who's your favorite teacher? I like who? Let's go ahead and write your name. If you are writing a Miss, like Miss Casto or Miss Carlson, you're going to write the letters M. S, hold on, let me show you. So you're gonna write an uppercase M, a lowercase S, and then a period, just like this. If your favorite teacher is a girl, it'll be Miss. If your favorite teacher is a boy, it'll be Mr, which is an M-R. That's just how we write these uh, labels. So that's how you write them for your favorite teacher, because we usually call them Miss or Mr. So I like Miss, who, or I like Mr. Who. Go ahead and sound out their name. I'll give you a few more seconds to sound it out. Good job, if you need more time, pause the video. So here we have so far, I like, hmm, What's our next word? Because, good job. So if you need help spelling it, you can pause the video here so that you have the word. I have it in my head because I've written it so many times, I've remembered it. So I'm gonna go ahead and write because, here we go. If you need more time, pause the video. So I like blank because why what's the first reason you like your teacher if you want if it's a she we spell that sight word s h e 
If it's a he, you write H E he. So for me, I'm going to write, I like Miss Carlson because she is happy. That'll be my reason. You'll write, I like, hmm, because she is, hmm, or he is, hmm. So go ahead and write those three words for now. All right, if you need a little more help, here's what mine looks like. She is happy. Hopefully you have a different reason than I do for Ms. Carlson. If you need more time, pause the video. So I know I'm moving a little fast today. It's because we got a lot to do. So um, we have our first reason. What's the magic word to add another reason? It's almost like math. It's almost like we're adding, we're putting together, we're putting our two reasons together. Look at that. We connected to math. Kiss you, right? So smart. So we have, I like blank because your first reason. And what else? What's another reason you like them? So that's your challenge today is to add your word and, A-N-D, and add your second reason then reread your writing, make sure it makes sense, and then draw me a fabulous picture. Don't forget what goes at the end of your sentence up here. Very good job. I'll see you next time.